Hello to all my lovely ladies and gentlemen out there. My name is Claudine and welcome back to my channel. If you're visiting my channel for the first time, welcome. I hope you enjoy this video and consider subscribing by hitting the red button down below. Today's video is actually a subby requested video for the MZ Wallace Harlow wristlet that you see right here. As always, I will provide you with some basic information on this wristlet, show you how I pack it, provide you with some mod shots of the wristlet, and lastly, give you my thoughts on this item. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, here is the lovely MZ Wallace Harlow wristlet. It measures 8.5 inches in length, approximately 5.5 inches in height, and about 7 eighths of an inch in depth. It also comes with a detachable crossbody strap that you see right here that measures from here all the way to the top, if I had it on there right now, about 22 inches. It retails for $215. At the time of this video being filmed, it is not currently available. So if you are considering this item, you would have to purchase it on the resale market. I have seen it out there in a number of colors, so it is possible. Now I'll give you a quick tour of the piece. Up close, you will see the classic pleating of MZ Wallace. And you can see that the zipper pull here, as well as the strap right here and the longer crossbody strap have this lovely detailing. It's kind of like a suede feel here with the grommets, but then on the side it's leather. And then, like I said, this is the zipper pull. You can open it up and you've got this outside compartment right here. You've got that lovely electric blue lining right there that you'll see. That's a glimpse into the awesome interior color. Backside is simple. You've just got the MZ Wallace New York logo right there. You've got a long zipper pull similar to the one that's right here. And this is the little strap that you see right here. If you look there, it says MZ Wallace on the hardware. See right there, and it's the same on this side as well. And this is completely removable. I personally just keep it on there. It adds a little personality, so I just leave it there. But this is totally removable if you wanted to, you know, just carry it as a clutch. But when you unzip it, you will be greeted with this lovely electric blue interior. What is that little white spot? Beautiful, beautiful electric blue interior. You see you've got one main compartment back here. And then you've got four credit card slots back here. One, two, three, four. You can see them better that way. Flip it around and you've got the one compartment right here that is typically for your public transit card. And then obviously the whole main compartment aside from that. So it's a very, very short and sweet tour of this adorable little wristlet. What I will do now is show you how I pack this. All right, here's the MZ Wallace Harlow wristlet. I took the liberty of filling in the four credit card slots for the sake of saving time on camera. So you can see those four slots are completely occupied like so. In this back compartment right here, I will typically place my cash. I will use it as a fill compartment. As you can see right there. In the main compartment, I will put my iPhone. It is an iPhone 8 Plus. I am actually filming on it right now, so I cannot use my actual phone, but here is one of my cases so that you can get an idea for the size. As you can see, it goes in there without any problem and with plenty of room to spare if you wanted to put anything else in there. I actually do not use this compartment right here for the public transit card. I actually prefer to put both my public transit card and my work ID in this outside compartment. So I've got two cards here that are serving as my pseudo work ID and public transit card, and they go right in there and I'm good to go. Now what I will do is provide you with some mod shots of the wristlet as a handheld bag and a crossbody bag. All right, here's the MZ Wallace Harlow wristlet as a handheld bag on me. You can also wear it in the crook of your arm like so, or as a clutch. Now what I will do is show you how the Harlow wristlet looks as a crossbody bag. Here is the MZ Wallace Harlow wristlet as a crossbody bag. For reference, I am five foot six, and like I said earlier in the video, the strap drop length is approximately 22 inches. 
So given that length and my height, it actually hits at a really lovely place. It's not too short, not too long. It works out really, really nicely on me. I'm very pleased. Unfortunately, I didn't think this through and wear a lighter colored top. So I am hoping you are getting a good idea for the size of the bag against my dark gray shirt. I apologize for that, but hopefully you are getting a good idea of the look of this beautiful little wristlet as a crossbody. I almost forgot to show you how to wear the Harlow wristlet as a wristlet, its namesake. Very easy to do. As you can see, I have the strap, just like a little short handbag strap right here. You simply unhook it on one end and hook it on the other with the other clasp. And there you have the little wristlet handle and you can carry it like so. And I'll step back now so you can see it for the purpose of a mod shot. I really like the MZ Wallace Harlow wristlet. If you recall a while back, I did a review of the MZ Wallace Crosby backpack. If you did not see that video, I will link it down below as well as at the end of this video. But when I did film that video, I showed you that I would pack this wristlet into that backpack. And if you're like me and will occasionally carry a backpack to work, this wristlet will serve an excellent purpose for those moments when you want to go run an errand in the middle of the day. You obviously wouldn't want to lug around that huge backpack unless you absolutely had to if you're running an errand. So this wristlet is great so that you could carry your essentials like your cash, your phone, your ID, go run that errand and come back with minimal items on hand. If you are the type of person that likes a wallet on chain, this is a wonderfully affordable option. If you are familiar with the high end brands of wallet on chains, you know those bags can run you into the thousands. This one costs $215. And on the resale market, you could probably find it for even less. So it is a carefree and stress-free option in the sense that, you know, it is a nylon fabric versus a leather, and it is a $215 bag versus a multi-thousand dollar bag, just depending on the brand you lean toward. So it is a great, great affordable option if you are looking for a wallet on chain. I would encourage you to consider the MZ Wallace Harlow wristlet. Check out the resale market, see what's out there. There are more colors than the black that you see right here. So if you were looking for a pop of color, you could certainly find that. And hopefully if that's what you're looking for, you will find it when you do your search. That is it for this video. If you liked it, please do give it that thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below and ding the bell so they are notified the next time I do upload a video. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.